Hey guys, it's Josh, and today I'm bringing you some Killing Floor gameplay. Just to explain, Killing Floor is a game by Tripwire. It's on Steam, it's only £15. I'm not sure what that is exactly in American dollars, but it's a lot of fun. So essentially, it's a zombie survival game. There is you and... The idea is it's a multiplayer game, but here I'm playing solo. And you have to excuse, this is the first time I've played in a while, so I'm adjusting some of the settings here. So, in essence, it's one large map where different zombies, different style zombies, so you'll have some slow ones, some faster ones, ones that shoot and ones that just try and scare the life out of you come at you and at the end of each wave you get the opportunity to go to a trader where you can buy different guns and according to the class that you pick currently I'm a commando which is essentially a bullet hose you get to, some guns are cheaper and some guns have bonuses attached to them but there's nothing stopping you like there's nothing stopping me as a commando from randomly picking up a grenade launcher and using it Oh, and as you saw there, there are various things lying on the ground for you to pick up, like ammo or weapons. Oh, and another thing. Currently, um, they're going through a festive period, and so the zombies look kind of different, as you can see here. But this is a great game. It's a lot of fun to play, especially with friends. And genuinely, this is one of the games that will keep shocking me. Not because it's a scary game in essence, but you'll see at points, see what I did there? Tried to throw a grenade and turn too quickly and threw it in front of me. Yeah, there, you'll see there are points where I turn around and proverbially jump in the air because something's behind me and it shocked me. Oh, just to explain what I'm doing here, this is more of an example of how not to play. So you go into this room and, oh god, they're coming at me. Run, 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 hope there shouldn't be any downstairs, and oh god, keep shooting, don't stop shooting, don't stop shooting. Anyway, you get the idea and you can watch me play. And I'm also you taking the opportunity here to... Well, that shocked me too. Um, even now. I'm taking the opportunity to provide a little update on my life, sort of like a gameplay vlog. Anyway, so yeah, this morning my family left on holiday for, at 5am. Uh, yep, that sort of stuff happens too. Yeah, at 5am. No, they didn't leave without me. I'm going on holiday with, with my friends this Sunday. But I got up at 5am to say goodbye, help them pack their final stuff. And then they left and at 6am I went back to sleep. Or tried to, it took a while. Oh, hello, lever action rifle. Good, good fun. Yeah, oh, oh, this is a, this actual gun that I'm using now, it's more of a sharpshooter class. There is a sharpshooter class and that's what it's meant for, but as I said, there's nothing stopping any class picking up and using it. It's just that sharpshooter class get, I think, an extra damage bonus when using it. Yeah, so they left on holiday at 5am and I went back to sleep, woke up at midday, started, went on the computer and started doing this. And I just, they recently phoned me saying they, they landed and they're happily driving around getting to the hotel. Which is all good fun. But yeah, I'm home alone that means, and that means I've got a lot of free time to do not much. Boom, headshot. Good fun. Anyway, so I think I'm coming to the end of the wave and I'm trying to find where the trader is. You see in the arrow in the top left it's pointing towards it. Oh and yes, this is retro style gaming. When you have the knife you will run quicker. And I, I think about this point, I realise, yeah, the trade is underground. Uh, okay, fine. Better kill this zombie first. And so, as you can see in the bottom right corner, there is a money counter, and you get bonuses for completing the round and killing. Well, you don't get bonuses for you don't get money for killing zombies. You get mo bonuses for doing damage to them, which is quite nice because that means there's no real such thing as um, kill stealing, because you don't get you don't get paid by the kill. You get paid by the damage. Oh, and here I just got a bit annoyed because they, for for newcomers, they provide helpful hints in the top right corner. And here I'm thinking to myself, right, I may not have played this game in ages, but I am not a newcomer. Turn it off, 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 off. completely off. As in dead, dead off. All right, guns list. Yes, I am buying the AK-47. Not sure. Is that the full AK-47 or uh, the short AK-47? I don't know. All I know is that. No, that's a full AK-47. All I know is I have no money, and you do not want to be caught underground here when the when the z zombies start spawning, or the Zeds, as they are sometimes called. I don't understand that. Here, I was trying to shut the door. Like, can I shut the door, please? Oh. So well, this is one of my favourite maps on the game because there's a the, the where I'm going to now is a very nice place to camp, essentially, and let the zombies come to you. The only other thing what you'll see me do wrong here is that I don't move around enough. 
I don't know why I shut this door here. Maybe I was hoping that it would do something funky. I don't know. You need to move around a lot. And it's also at this point why you will see another reason why this game will constantly surprise me. Especially when I'm playing alone or when I'm playing online with people. The, this game will keep on shocking. So, killing them, turn around. Oh my god, what are you doing there? That's a stalker, by the way. They, they're, for the most part, invisible, but because I'm a commando, they start, when they come near me, I get to see their glowing red outlines. But for every other person, they're mostly invisible, with sometimes a hazy blur, and you can hear their laughter. So when you're trying to walk around the map and you hear their laughter, and you're not a commando, you're, like, looking around going, ah, uh, where are they? And then your screen starts to flash red as they, as they stab you. And it's getting pretty hectic now. I'm... You can, you can see what happens if you don't stop me. Oh, and there's a... That is a siren. They hurt a lot. Oh, boom. Slow motion. Yeah, that's very cool. That's a lot of fun when you go into slow motion you get to blow things up. Whoa, come on. Everyone likes it. Now, this, this is where I failed. And the main reason I failed here is because I didn't move. I should, here I was... I got a bit cocky thinking, yeah, me and my AK-47, I can survive here. Bang, bang, bang. And no. You can't. There's a siren coming at you, and everything else is trying to kill you. Don't do it. And as you can see there, I got wiped out. Rather, rather undignified for my first attempt in ages. You would have thought I'd be a tiny bit better, but hey, you know what? So be it. Anyhow, guys, um, hope you enjoyed it. Leave a response, and maybe you'll be seeing more of this later. See ya.